by self-interest and greed, with an insatiable appetite to satisfy Wall Street and the 1%. Woo! All this at the expense of the 99%. All this at the expense of the customer, with little or no repercussion when they fail them. All this at the expense of their skilled workforce, expected to do much more with less, and today for less. All this at the expense of our community, as work is outsourced to places like India, Mexico, and the Philippines. Verizon, stop your tax dodging greedy behavior. Main Street before Wall Street, workers before for India, Mexico, or the Philippines. Verizon is the 1%. Clear profit, $1 billion each and every month. Get more profits. That ain't right. That ain't right. In a bad economy. From 2008 to 2010, Verizon owed $11 billion in federal taxes. But instead, close received close to a billion dollars in tax rebates. Share the wealth. Share the wealth. These savings, these savings should have been used to eliminate the outsourcing of work by creating jobs in every community they do business in. These savings should have been done to universally deploy the state-of-the-art telecommunication services in every one of our communities to empower and enrich our communities. These savings should have been used to settle our outstanding labor dispute, offering a fair and just contract to their workforce. These savings could have been done, could have been used to motivate and influence and strengthen the 99%. Instead, the very greedy, wireless executives decide to use their tax savings to wage an all-out assault on their workforce, demanding givebacks on hard-fought past victories over wages, benefits, working conditions, and job security, further eroding our middle-class standard of living. These savings could have been used. Verizon's greedy executives decided to use these savings to reward themselves. Their top, their top five executives took home $255 million in compensation over the last four years. Their former CEO, Ivan Seidenberg, prior to retirement, $55,000 a day in salary. Let's set the record straight. We want Verizon to do well. When Verizon does well, we should all do well. We want the 1% to do well. When the 1% does well, we should all do well. And we should all do our part. We should all pay our fair share of taxes. We are one. We are the 99%. That begins with paying 